Well, it's time to uh, go do the main quest. Hang on, I'm just going to turn in that side quest for Medesi because I don't know. It's the one I never do. Whenever I always played this game, I was like, okay, Mammoth Tusk, easy. Also make great profit. Um, gold ore, easy. Also make good profit. Flawless sapphires? I don't know if he has the money for that, because those things are expensive. See you finally came to your senses. Ready to make some coin? All right. Honored. Take them. Good. These will make wonderful settings for my rings. You don't need flawless sapphires to make rings. No, I think I have enough here to get started. Two hundred gold too. That was fucking nothing. It's the least I can do for all your trouble. Silver necklace. Safe travels, Lance. <laughs> Absolute garbage. I upgraded Marak's sword to legendary. I mean, I can do that if I use a Daedra Heart, but it gives me less damage than my uh, Flying Axe of Baghdad. Also, I did decide to make a uh, an axe of basically uh, fill empty soul gems, because I actually have a ton of those. Let's count how many I have, shall we? Yeah, I have 12 empty grand soul gems and 6 empty greater soul gems, so... uh. Uh, I think I have some empty, yeah, three empty black soul gems too. So, yep. As soon as I can use those, the better. Really, giant? Alright, well, time to take out Damages the Soul. Damages the Soul. Oh, by the way, I put a uh, petty soul gem on it. So, uh, it has only one second until I get soul trapped. But it has like a hundred uses, so it doesn't really matter. Hey, loser. How are you doing? I figured out how we're going to get you into the Thalmor Embassy. Yeah, I just killed the first Dragonborn, so uh, you should, you know. Wait, wouldn't you be serving Marak then? Hmm. I didn't take long. Just kidding. It took like so three months. Remember? Why are there three Khajiits here? This is obviously like where the Khajiit caravan spawns. This one needs something. But like, um. Tools, wares, and weapons. <laughs> All for sale. Jesus. Hang on, I want to check if the the secret the secret box is still here. I, I remember back from playing the original that if you like sneak around and like you put the cursor in the right spot, yeah. Uh, there's a secret chest here which contains everything in this dude's inventory. Now he, he's lucky that I am, you know, doing the whole. I'm not going to exploit any cheats or anything like that. Aside from that one time I used the wooden plate, otherwise I'd rob him blind, and he, there's nothing he can do about it. And then you can talk to him and refresh his inventory. On this day, I go to Sovngarde. Demonetize! Eh, just kidding. Don't care, I only did this for one reason. Let me talk to him. Okay, can't search him, he's busy. I just wanted his amulet of Talos. Because it's a quest item. So it weighs nothing. Some gate guard you are. <laughs> He's already dead. You don't need to harass him beyond the grave. Uh, take one of each of my axes. Um, I don't actually need my armor, actually. You know what? For the sake of role-playing reasons, I won't take my armor. Take uh, the necklace of magic suppression, though. Alright. I look like a damn fool. Then again, um, this is the only other time in the game you're going to be able to see the face of supposedly Booth the Vile. Take a good look. Wonderful. How come she gets to use a glass dagger and I don't get any weapons? Okay, her, her dagger has disappeared. Wonderful. Alright. Okay, <laughs> nice door closing animation. Alright, let's put on Damages the Soul and Flying Axe of Baghdad. I'm gonna equip the Amulet of Talos. What else do I have that's plot relevant? This is a good way to find out everything that I have that I can't get out of my inventory. Curious Silver Moles. The two Attunement Sphere. Are these are plot relevant? I guess they are. Uh, you're not even supposed to have two. You're supposed to have, like, one. But somehow I, somehow I got the other one. I don't know. But, uh, yeah... It's good to know what I can't get rid of. I got detected already? Jesus. Very perceptive. No soul gem large enough? Oh, I'm not carrying any soul gems. Right, I should have given them to what's-his-name. 
kind of forgot that. Alright, well, give me your armor. It's it's light armor, so it does, like, nothing for me. But hey, maybe I'll get some experience. Just kidding. Uh, necklace of Magic Suppression and uh, Disciple or whatever it is of Mara. Uh, you actually cannot do damage to me. Like, how did they detect me so quickly? Granted, I know I have, like, no sneak. That's why that potion is there, because it gives you extra sneak. But, uh, yeah. That's, that's not supposed to happen. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe that all of the uh, gear, like, that gets, um, spawned in here is leveled. And by gear, I mostly mean, like, potions and junk like that. Okay. Walk out. Actually, I, I grabbed, um... Uh, Elven gear, so I can... Oh, wait, no, you need Thalmor robes, don't you? Like, like, uh, yeah, enemies won't aggro on you if you're on, uh, range. But I guess that's not right. Oh, well. No soul gem large enough. It's just because I'm holding none. Stop running away. God damn, he's fast. Try not to, uh, just... Oh, hang on. Named dude. Okay, got, just got stuck on the ceiling for a second there. Oh, knocked him right into the gourds. Bound battle axe. Holy crap, he had a whole bunch of good stuff. That stuff would have actually been useful if you're trying to kill these losers. If I didn't have my axes, I'd be using bound sword. Alright, will the dude spawn now? I thought there was a thing here that happened where, um... Like, they'd escort Malbjorn over here and say, You'd best give up, otherwise we'll kill your friend here. And I guess he died anyway. Lock cannot be picked, requires a key to open. Alright, where's the key? Did the quest just get soft-locked because uh, there's no, um... There's, I don't have a key to open this. And th there is none around here. If I recall, there was supposed to be a guy here that is talking to the, the loser dude. But, um... Yeah. Didn't spawn. Well, time to go to the wiki, see if I broke this quest or if it was potentially broken anyway. So I need to enter this command prompt and this will fix the bug. So, uh, yeah, hopefully that fixes this soft lock. Yep, okay, there he is. Let's get out of here. Because these guys have the key to this area. I will... So, yeah, uh, interrogation trapdoor key. There we go. So, uh, that's the first time I've actually had a quest glitch out on me, so that's good. Now the Thalmor will be hunting me for the rest of my life. I hope it was worth it. Yep, that was definitely worth it. It's okay though, you didn't die. Also, praise the wiki for actually having information on how to fix this stupid glitch that happened. I can though. Oh hey, unusual gem, nice. Just take the spell tomes as well, search the satchels for the stuff. Alright, and everyone's running away. You didn't have to help me. Oh, Ethian cultist. God damn it, Melbion died because some random cultist decided to attack me. <laughs> Great. Well, I guess that unlocks the Boethius calling quest. Rest in peace, Melbion. I actually did my best to save you, but you died anyway. And now there's a dragon. And the dragon's gone. Great. I actually wanted to bend Will, the dragon, so I could, uh... <laughs> ride him all the way back to, uh, Riverwood, but I guess this is fine. Great. Another achievement. Diplomatic immunity. A cornered rat! No, rat! Ah, uh, yes, the duality of man. Elven braces of wielding or major sure grip. Wonderful. I just want that rested bonus. Wait, why is Sam Guavirin here? I thought he was supposed to spawn in Whiterun. Oh well, I guess I can do the drinking contest with him at some other point. Just kidding, I'm probably not going to do it ever. Since when was there a Khajiit in Riften? I don't recall. 
Anyway, I'm going outside just to browse the water and get that one last piece of nern root so I don't have to worry about it again. Hey, I've got those ingredients. Sorry. Ah, oh, yes, excellent samples. Thank you. This coin should compensate you for all the bother. No amount of coin can compensate for how much problems there was. Yep, okay, that was yes. all. What do I get Master now? Will be pleased I've restored his stock of these rare ingredients. I wouldn't count Death Bell as rare, you find that all over the place. Nope, that's not it. Ah, oh, here it is. Um, uh, 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 nope. Nothing interesting. This place has seen better days. Powerful potions, but they don't fit with my build. You know, I don't think I've ever actually entered Beggar's Row. It's just a place that doesn't exist. Get out of my way! Damn cats. Following me all over the city. Ah! The hell? I'm trying to spawn in one of the NPCs because I've been inadvertently collecting uh, Ice Wraith Teeth. So I wanted to give five of them to one of the NPCs that spawns here. Who the hell are you? Clinic brings food supplies up to them once every few weeks. Wait, what are you? Aren't you one of the people who's supposed to be in um? Don't really know too much about the 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 place next to High Hrothgar. Hang on, let me check my quest. Yeah, it's one of the things in the Book of Love was a. Uh, it isn't Temple of Marak, it's the Book of Love. It's a uh, talk to Bas Basianus or Klimic, and he's right here. Why is he here? He shouldn't be here. You're not supposed to be here. Ah! Why is with Why is everyone running up to me now? Here for the Welcome here. to the Bee and Barb, I presume you're bothering If I can interest you in one of our special drinks. Like, everyone is in my face today. Like a bad theme. But yeah, the merchant that is usually around here that wants Ice Wraith Teeth is not spawning for some reason. That's incredibly odd. Okay, there's a guard just just walking around with fist raised. You're supposed to be holding a torch, but you're not. <laughs> just uh, need to poke the thumb up for a second there, but yeah. Oh yeah, business permanently, aka the glitch that causes him to um, do the thing and not actually get out of jail. How much does it cost? How much does it cost? 80% chance to place. Okay, Doc's dungeon odds. Well, I see that my time is up. Come back tomorrow if you wish. How much does it cost? Oh, okay. Come back tomorrow. Also, what souls do humans have? I kind of forget if they were greater or grand. Let's see what I've got. Uh, I've got 12 grand soul gems that are empty, and five that are empty and greater soul gems. What the? Why do I hear doors opening? Oh. Uh, yeah, that is what I want. Alright, that was loud. Twelve and five. Are they petty? Or are they lesser? Or are they common? Oh no, it's filling up my black soul gems. Okay, so they are black. So I guess grand? Also, I like how you can get early access to the uh, ratway by picking this lock. Okay, not the ratway, but the, uh, the Thieves Guild part of the ratway. I do enjoy that you can just do this and uh, skip like all of the stuff here. Wow, you've got a lot of health for a normal low life. But yeah, that fills up my black soul. Wait, are you telling me that filling a soul gem that's been stolen makes it not stolen anymore? That is an odd design choice. Also, why is there an ore here? There's one other dude I wanted to kill in here. That's G on the fist. God damn it. I keep forgetting that the second, like, the offhand weapon attacks first if you do a power attack. But, uh, yeah, got his increased melee damage gloves. Unique enchantment for him, so... Don't get it now. Never will. Also, why is this pot here? Like, usually these things are on a string or something. This is not. I can hear you clearly through the, uh, That's close wall. That's close enough. Well tonight, my darling. No more. I yield, I yield. 
<laughs> Poor demented souls. What is that that's hostile on the minimap? Spare me, please. I didn't even choose to fight you. You came out of your door and like, I don't know. Please don't kill me. Oh, are you trying to talk to him as well? Go away. Yes. What? No, that's not me. We're both your friend. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Great. Will this dude become friendly to me and instantly go after whoever that is? Deaf person, help me. <laughs> Be my meat shield. There we go. No! Esburn, you fool! You killed her! And your... Your frost atronach was just sliding everywhere. Near what's what? Known as Sorry, he didn't say anything. I cut that out, so, uh... He's not in the plot. Um... I'll, I'll, I'll meet you there, because I'm just gonna fast travel. I just don't want to be with you. Oh, achievement. Explorer. No, I'm not gonna stay. Gotten a ton of achievements. Probably none of the ones that, like, nobody has. I, I looked up briefly and I saw the one for slaying Mirak wasn't that common. As it had the, like, the Steam achievement glow of, hey, not many people have this. I guess many people just didn't get as far as to, you know, kill Mirak. I bet a bunch of people didn't even go to Solstheim. Let me see if this works. Uh, where is Ben Will? Okay, this blood dragon is mine. Alright. Screw horses. I'm riding a dragon. Okay, you cannot control the dragon, so uh, using dragon or bend will is completely pointless. So I will not do that. You know, one of the things I don't get about the plot is, uh, you need to call Odaving to the, uh, like, white run in order to do the thing. But wouldn't Bend Will also theoretically work? Now, Delphine and Esba need to come along here, so I'm pretty sure I do actually need to clear them away. What the heck is that dragon? I didn't call that one. Oh my god. Fucking freezing idiots. Right, hang on, let me go inside so I can get some of them to follow me and kill them. Oh, I don't need to? Oh, they're already here. Nice. Well, that was easy. You know, for somewhere that gets active light, there seems to be a surprisingly low amount of 1. water damage, and 2. actual light. Man, I was monologuing so that I could hope that these dudes would actually catch up and get up here without me having to use weight again, but it seems not. I waited five fucking hours for this dude to get up here. It is night time now. Is it? No, it's not night time, it's just... Oh, that's 12 a.m. Uh, yes, it is night time. Well, technically really early morning, but who cares for nuance? Hey, Dragon Bane, that's a unique weapon, isn't it? What does it do? 30 points extra damage to dragons, 10 points of shock damage to others. Does that mean it does 40 points of damage to dragons? Or does others mean, like, not, like, specifically not dragons? Okay, full set of blades armor. It's not really bad. But I'm not interested in it. There's that dragon that's flying around over there. Maybe I should go kill it. It seems like an ancient dragon, maybe? An ancient dragon's got drop good loot. At least that's what I hear. And it's not moving, it is like static in the sky. It is getting pelted with like ice shards from that frost atronach. I don't think dragons work like this. Okay, it is a fire dragon. Okay, it decided to look at me. Okay, this is kind of pathetic. Don't tell me that this dragon is going to die from a bunch of shitty Forsworn Frost Atronauts. Okay. Whoa! Sonic Speed! 
<laughs> glitched out. Do I really have to run over there and chase him down? Oh, it's an elder dragon, yeah. Wow, if he had full health, he wouldn't have survived that. I like how the battle music isn't playing, it's just calm music. Rest in peace, Elder Dragon. Good thing I don't have to use my dragon souls on them. Giving me three souls worth of power here. That's like one quarter of what Mirak gave me, but Mirak was like an evil bad guy. Perilous? If I recall correctly, um, there's literally no enemies up here. You could have just, like, done the bloody thing. What was it? Let me see if this glitch works, still. So, I spent my perk getting... a uh, word of power. I believe this will give me the second word. Yep, okay, now I do know too. Show me what you can do. Greet me not as orc. Okay, he does notice that I'm orc as well. But why? Why must you stop Alduin? Well, it's because uh dragons are obviously returning to Skyrim in the world. True. But are dragons necessary evil? Like these dragons, most of them are following Alduin, and like the only reason Odoving helps you is because he believes that the dragon one has a chance to uh, stop Alduin. So in theory, if uh, Alduin were gone, then most likely the dragons would become a lot more uh, tolerant and peaceful. What? You can't do a spin attack with a two-handed weapon? That's not how it works. Perhaps the knowledge that they used to defeat Alduin was in fact a spin attack you could do with a two-handed weapon. That power. Perhaps it's two more than mortal is able to handle. Maybe the Greybeards were right. This power should not be learnt. That works. gonna fight me. Just use my signature combo. Go away, Parthenax. I don't need your help. I already did. You died in like six seconds. I'm pretty sure I'm greater than they are. I, <laughs> I have... Okay, just float into the sky, Parthenex. <laughs> this game is scuffed. Right, we all know why I really came up to this mountain. To get the damn pickaxe. There we go, notched pickaxe. I'm still not going to use it, I'm just going to use my uh, ancient Nord pickaxe, because this one can mine Stolrim. One last enchantment I swiped from the uh, weapon store. Paralysis. So, I... I still don't have drain magic, but, I mean, not drain magic, drain health, but hopefully I'll still, okay, fine, I won't find that, I've just given up at this point. Well, I guess that'll be the end of this episode. This was a half episode recording because I messed up with the length of the last recording session because I ended up using a lot more of that footage than I thought I would. But, next episode should be the finale, maybe. It may be an extra long one, but... That's just how Skyrim do be. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video of Skyrim, which will go kill Alduin. And maybe, maybe after that I'll have a special thing, you know, for a follow-up episode. But until then, goodbye.